have to be honest for a moment that I think some of us are doing a better job of creating disciples of other people and other places and other things than disciples of Jesus. And I say that because I've been guilty of it sometimes. There have been weeks where I've walked and I'm like, you know what? I think the words of that vacation I took that was so amazing, I think the words about that were on my lips more than the name of Jesus. And I wonder if I, I made disciples out of a travel this week. Or, or sometimes there's a news headline that got my attention and like maybe riled me up and I'm talking about it with people and I'm like, I wonder if that got so much in my heart this week that I made a better disciple of that news article than I did of the person of Jesus. There's been times in my life where I really love a restaurant or you got to watch this TV show and I'm spending so much time talking about this TV show to other people. I made a better disciple of a TV show than I did of Jesus because wherever our heart lies, whatever is on our lips, we reproduce who we are and these are the type of disciples we make. And this is why I say personal discipleship, how you and Jesus are, the time you spend in his word, the time you spend in prayer, the time you spend here on a Sunday, the time you say, not my will, but yours be done. That so matters if we're going to heed the call to go and make disciples, which brings us to the other part of discipleship. The discipleship is not and cannot just be personal. It cannot just be about you and Jesus. Discipleship is a communal call. 